Oh, hi. I decided that since it's Friday, I'm gonna do math on the old comfy couch. Does that sound okay to you? Doesn't matter what you think, because I'm doing it. Let's start with this stick right here. This is a 10 stick. Let's check it and make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, we are going to count up uh, from 10 up to 20, but we're going to do it the say 10 way, okay? This is 10. This is 10. 1. 10. 2. 10. 3. 10. And 4. One more is 10. And 5. Oh! Oh, I'm taking one away. Ten, four. Ten, five. One more than ten, five is ten, six. One more than that is ten, seven. Oh, I'm taking one away again. You know what that is? Ten, six. Ten, seven. Ten, Eight, ten, nine, and ten, ten. Ten and ten makes twenty, right? Okay, now I got my Unifix cubes. I've got the hide ten cards, and I've got my reckon wreck here and now what we're going to do is we're going to i'm going to make numbers that you say you tell me a number and i'm going to make it the f uh go ahead and start shouting numbers between one ten and twenty i'm not going to do one through ten just ten through twenty so I'm gonna, what's that i heard somebody say fifteen i'm going to make fifteen with my unifix cubes so i've got ten and one, two, three, four, five. There, I made 15. Okay, thanks, whoever said 15. Let's do one with the high 10 cards. I got 10, I got my ones here. Did somebody say 19? What's that? You said 19? Okay, gotta find a nine here. Here we go. This nine looks like an upside down six. So we take 10 and nine, and I put it, and I make 19. Thanks, guys. Okay, let's hear another number. 12? Did you say 12? Yeah, I could do 12. Let's do 12 with the wreck and wreck. 10 and two. 12. Thanks. Okay, somebody else. Hmm. Can't really hear you very good this time. 17? 17? 17 with the unifix cubes. Let's do 17 with the unifix cubes. Here's 10, and I'm gonna need seven more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 17. Bam, here's 17. Okay, thanks. Now, another number. Um. Who said four? Four is not between 10 and 20. Come on, you guys, say the right numbers. Mm. Oh, 14, yeah, I can do 14. Let's look for a four in here. Oh, got it right here. Okay, with my high 10 cards, I'm gonna do 10 and four. Here it comes, 14. The four hides the 10, a 10 and a four, 14. Thanks. Okay, it's Wreck and Wreck's turn. Give me a good one this time, you guys. 20? Did you say 20? That's 10 and 10. 10 and 10 more make 20. Good one, guys. Okay, back to Unifix cubes. Hmm, what's somebody gonna say? Uh, 11? Ha, huh, that's easy. 10 and if I was easy, one more. 10 and one more is 
11. Okay? Let's do another high, uh, high zero card. Come on, you gotta be louder than that. I can't hear you. Uh, 18? Did you say 18? I can do 18. I got an 8 in here somewhere. Where are you, 8? Oh, there he is. Okay. We got a 10, and we got 8. 18. Thanks for that one. Okay. Let's do one more with the Wreck and Wreck. Hmm. How, um, what did you say? What? Say it louder, I can't hear you. 16? Okay, 16. 10 and 6 make 16. All right. Well, that was fun. Thanks for all the suggestions. Let me show you your work today. On the problem set, you've got these, it says, the ducks found some tasty fish to eat in the boxes. So this um, duck found this one, and it's between the 11 and the 13. How many fish do you think are inside of this box? It's 12. 12. So, I want you to write a 12 there, and then I want you to figure out how many fish are in each of the missing boxes. Okay? And it goes from 11 to 20. And then there's another one says, write the missing number for the boxes that have a duck on top. So whatever there's a duck on top, there's a blank underneath it. And that's where you have to write the number. On the back of this, yes, there's finally a back. They want you to count all of the ducks and write the number there. So count all of these ducks and write the number there. Here it says in the space below, draw 15 circles in rows. Now, probably you should do rows of five, but they just want you to do 15 circles in rows. And then the last one says, in this space below, draw 12 squares in rows. Circles here, squares here. And then you're done with your worksheet. Your exit ticket, this is a pretty fun exit ticket. I was looking at this one. They want you to count, do this later on today. Count how many stars there are and put it on the blank there. Then, it says, look at the three sets of blocks, count the shade of blocks in each set, and circle the set that has the same number of, as, of shade of blocks as the stars are. So whatever is the same number as this, circle either this one, this one, or this one. Nice big circle. Then down here it says, which is easier to count, stars or blocks? That's an interesting question. Okay, we're done with math. Hope I see you guys uh, later. Have a great day. Bye-bye.